There's so many reasons that I love surfing. My passion for surfing basically started um, with my dad. I was teaching paddleboarding at the same time growing up being a surfer. Being in the here, in the now, in the present, being in the moment when you're out on the water and you're surfing and you're having that conversation with that wave, there is nothing else. When you're drawing a line on a wave with your board and you do it the way you've envisioned and your timing is just right, there's something about that that for me is communicating with something bigger than yourself. Because these waves have traveled across the ocean and you're meeting them there. And then from there, every weekend my dad would take me paddle boarding. We would go paddle flat water. We would go slowly start to paddle into the waves. And as I grew up, I just got more and more into it. I look at a wave a little bit differently and it's kind of grew the, my stoke and my passion for getting on little bumps. That's really what got me plugged in and kept me going for this sport. The memories that are all compiled in my surfing part of my brain, I just want to keep growing that library and keep building on those memories because every single one of them is special. I used to think that you had to be an expert surfer to call yourself a surfer, but a good friend once told me that as long as I had the passion behind it, that I am a surfer. When it comes to stand-up paddleboarding, the surfing side is definitely where my passion is. And I feel really fortunate that I work with the design team at Thick HUP and that we're able to work collaboratively on these shapes. For uh, 2016, I'm amped about the new Wave Pro range. Super excited about them because of their construction, because of the durability, and more importantly, because of the performance in all the boards. And on the Wave Pro boards, because of the pulled in narrow tail and the positioning of the fins, it just holds on the bottom like no other board I've ridden. 